Hi everyone, my name is Jane and for today's National Science Week experiment I'm going to show you how you can use baking soda and vinegar to create an awesome chemical reaction. Alright, to get started there's a few things you'll need. So first up you'll need some vinegar, you'll also need an empty soft drink container. This is optional but I'm going to pop in a little bit of red food dye to make it a little bit more colourful. You'll also need some baking soda. So make sure it's baking soda and not baking powder. That's very important. And I'm also going to, I've got a little bit of a shallow container here. So when I do my experiment, I'm going to actually pop my bottle in here. So whatever might happen will spill into the container and not onto the floor. So for you at home, make sure you've got your parents' permission and it would be great if they could help you out as well. All right, let's get started. So first up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop a couple of drops of my food dye into my vinegar here. Right, take that one off. Go one, two, let's go one more. Three. Okay, pop the lid back on. And I'm just going to mix that round a little bit so the vinegar turns red. Okay, so our vinegar is ready to go. Now, let's add our baking soda to our container. So I've got this little funnel, so if you've got one at home, this might help you out. So I'll pop that over the top, and then I've got some baking soda. And I'm gonna pour some in. So just shake that around. Okay, and then you can see sort of covers the bottom bit of the soft drink bottle. All right, are you ready for the chemical reaction? Okay, let's get our vinegar ready. So let's pour it in, see what happens. You can see why we need this container, can't you? So when you're trying this at home, you might like to change around some of the quantities. So maybe pop a little bit more bicarb soda or baking soda, or maybe a little more vinegar and see what happens. But I guess you're probably wondering, why does this happen? Well, this happens because the, ba the baking soda is the base while the vinegar is an acid. So when they react together, they form carbonic acid, which is very unstable, and it instantly breaks apart into water and carbon dioxide, which creates all the fizzing as it escapes the solution. Thank you for joining me for today's experiment. I hope you have fun trying it out at home. We'll see you next time. Bye.